It's time for College Hoops on 2K Sports. The North Carolina AMT Aggies battle the Delaware State Hornets. We've got a great matchup for you today. Welcome, everyone. We're here at Memorial Hall. This is Burr Munkwith with Bill Raftery and Tracy Wilson. Give us your take, Bill. This game features a great matchup at the point guard position. Number two, he's a fantastic player. He's got great touch around the rim. He's a real dangerous post presence. Rush is also a tremendous point guard. If you drive the lane when he's down there, you're taking a chance. He's an intimidating defensive presence. They're both ready to go. We'll see which of the two can lead their team to victory. The crossover. Hit it, got fouled, and he'll have a shot at the three-point play. Takes it up. Tacks on the free throw for the three-point play. Let's check in with our sideline reporter, Tracy Wolfson, who has some info for us. Vern, earlier today I spoke with Coach Jackson. He told me the number one thing that jumps out at them about this opponent and their athleticism. He said it may be fun to watch a team like this, but it is not a lot of fun to defend against. We'll see if his players feel the same way after this game. Thank you, Tracy. He got the look he wanted to there, Bill. I wouldn't let him have too many more of those. He can light you up in a hurry. Poke loose. Out of bounds. Touch last by North Carolina EMT. Dickens inbounds the ball. Dumps it down low. Number two. The Hornets were the last ones to touch it, and they'll turn it over. That could have been avoided, Vern. He might have been a little too concerned with the defense. Passes to the elbow. Nice little crossover. He gets hammered. Bill heads a first one. Second foul. Second team foul. Shooting two. Daniel takes it up. Can't sink the first. Goes up. Good on number two. Dickens. Pokes free. The Hornets will retain possession. Dickens inbounds the ball. Bright dumps it off. Number two. Releases. Hits the three-pointer. And they're now behind by seven. Daniel. Goes to the crossover. Hangs. Gets a piece of it. He read that shot so beautifully. He knew exactly when to go up and get that one. Wonderful execution. Misfired on that last three by Johnson. Throws it up. The 17-footer was on the mark by Rush. They push the lead to nine. Under 18 minutes left in the half. Catches it outright. The tumbo snatches the rebound. It's still early, Vern, but they can't take any more time to get this thing going. It hasn't been pretty for them so far. The last long ball was off the mark by Daniels. The offensive board gathered by Sandage. These guys are getting serious on D. That's tough stuff right there. Rush fires off the mark thanks to the tight D. They're still up by nine. Knocked loose, and it's scooped up by Daniels. Daniel has done it. Probably the greatest defensive season in NCAA history. We can now say it, no one, no one has ever made more steals in a single year than this young man. His jersey is going to the Hall of Fame in Springfield, Vern. Can you believe that we were here to see this? This young man worked very hard for this. 
I hope he basks in the moment for a while and enjoys it. They're ahead, 14 to 5. One on one, Daniel passes to the perimeter. Stolen away by Delaware State. Johnson lays it up Johnson. and in. They've got it within seven. Fades away. The shot was knocked down by Daniels. And they now go up by 10. Just over 16 minutes left in the half. Poked away. And it's gathered up by Daniels. Picked him clean. Well, the game just slows down for him to the point he sees things that others don't. Number two brings it up the floor. Knocks it loose. Rush passes it up court. Daniel, the finisher, hits it. Daniels by 15. Delaware State is struggling on defense, and Tracy has a quick report from their bench. Coach Jackson is not at all happy with the drought they're going through and told his assistants to find a way, any way, to turn this one around. All right, Tracy. Coach Jackson might have decided to switch things up a little bit. He's going to take time to make sure everybody's clear on the game plan. Well, let's get back to the action. Dickens inbounds the ball. Oh, net on the shot by Johnson. Johnson. He's got four. Takes it up. Snatched by Sandage. About 15 and a half minutes left in the half. Outright, Dickens shoots it on target from 16 Dickens. feet. But they're still behind by 11. It looks like they're playing man-to-man. -man. Uses the crossover. He's doubled up. Goes up. Grabbed by Turner. The break is on. Rush. Good Rush. from downtown. He's two for two from three-point range. Beats it to the wing. Right. Rush for three. Deep. Got it. Rush. He's shooting 100% from deep. Number two brings it up. Here comes the double team. Dickens. Bounces it to the paint. Takes it up. Double clutched and laid in by Bright. They're now down by 13. Turner takes the shot. Can't get the three-pointer to fall. But they're still out in front by 13. Hooked away. And it's scooped up by Daniels. Goes up and dunks it down on the breakaway. They push their lead to 15. Under 14 minutes left in the half. Leads him in. Dickens has it out left. Once again, it's buried by Bright. They now trail by 13. Pulls the trigger. The three-pointer was no good by Turner. Still a 13-point lead. Tipped away. But it's recovered by number two. Gently drops it in. He's got five. Rush. Shoots from way back Rush. there. It's good. They're up 33 to 19. Bright. Finishes with the soft touch. But they're still down by 12. Let's it go. The three was drained Rush. by Rush. They're now up by 15. Pokes free, and it's gathered up by Daniels. Throws it up. Intercepted by Bright. Dishes to the top of the key. Poked loose, but it's recovered by number two. Bright raises up. 
good from three-point range. And they're now down by 12. One on one. Wilson. Matumbo pulls it in. He pulled down that offensive board like it was no problem. What a battler. Daniel uses the crossover. Johnson reels it in. Knocks it loose. It's two on one. Did he think the clock was winding down? I can't imagine what was going through his head on that play. Goes up. The oh, finger roll was flipped up and in by Bright. They're now behind by 10. Hit the left iron but missed by Turner. But they're still up by 10. Knocked loose. And it's gathered up by Daniels. Takes it up. Slams home a huge dunk. By 12. Right around 11 minutes left in the half. Four. The Hornets will bring in some players from off the bench. Dickens inbounds the ball. Bright has it in the corner. That last tray, no good. Dickens. North Carolina AMT has not been able to shut down the inside game at all. Tracy is by their bench with a report. The head coach just told the players on his bench, we have to be more physical in the paint. Don't be afraid of some contact. Sounds like he'd rather have some fouls called than to keep giving up all those easy baskets. Thanks, Tracy. Stolen by Daniels. Daniels. Rips it down. They take a 12-point lead. They're going to apply some pressure here and with full court. Man, man. Bright shoots from the post. Turner grabs the rebound inside. The steal. Uh, not a good entry pass, Fern. You just can't force it in there. Bright. Catches it on the elbow from about 19 feet. The shot was good by Bright. He's got 15. Daniel with the shot. Can't connect after the fadeaway. Still a 10-point lead. Poked away, but it's recovered by Delaware State. The steal by Wilson. He showed great hands on that steal. His man wasn't protecting the ball, and he just snatched it away from him. The Hornets can trim the lead to single digits. Knocked loose, but it's recovered by Johnson. Johnson feeds it to the left. That last basket was buried by Dickens. Dickens. Puts it up. Pulled in by Matumbo. Kicks it out to the outside. Daniel fires the three. Mutombo didn't get that rebound by accident. He knew right where to be. Hope's free, but it's recovered by Johnson. Another steal. Again, he's making big plays on defense to help his ball play. What cagey instincts on the defensive end. Johnson stepped back over the midcourt line so there. That's an over, over and back violation. That's just careless, Vern. He wasn't watching where he was on the court. Turner inbounds the ball. Knocks it loose, but it's retrieved by Turner. Puts it up. Snatched down inside by Matumbo. What a last line of resistance. You gotta come strong with that fella in there. Tipped away. And it's scooped up by Turner. Daniel goes up. Caps the break with a tremendous jam. They're in front. 42 to 32. Johnson wasn't watching the line there. That's going to be over and back. The North Carolina A&T coach made some changes that could affect their chemistry a little bit. I don't think these guys have played together very often. Jones unloads. Matumbo corrals the miss inside. What a turnaround. He was raining those in before, but all of a sudden, he's gotten a little cold out there. But they still lead by 10. Poked loose, but it's recovered by Johnson. Stolen by Daniels. It's two on one. 
Lobs it up. Great defensive play leads to a quick bucket. Aggressive D like that can shift momentum on you in a hurry. Coach Jackson saw something out there he didn't like, and he called for a timeout. He wants to make sure that everyone is working together out there. Dickens inbounds the ball. Parks, here's the spin move. Nice little double clutch there on the lay-in. Crosses it over. Dishes it to the left. 14 feet out. Perfect shot by Coleman. They're now out in front by 12. They're bringing the double team. Hooked away. Dickens hands it off. Spike down. Oh, what a shot. He looked like a volleyball player spiking that thing. Ewing tosses it up. He's off with the three-pointer. They've still got a 12-point lead. They're playing a 3-2 zone. Your big men have to be alert when they come out in this deep. That last basket was nailed by Dickens. For three. Can Jones. by Jones. He's one for two from downtown. They're going to double team him. Neal, way up court. Johnson leads him with the pass. The beautiful pass led straight to the layup by Neal. But they're still behind by 11. Leads him with the pass. Coleman double clutches. Can't get the layup. But they're still out in front by 11. The steal by Daniels. Daniels. That's it. Just first, too first, much first, contact there, Bird. You're not going first. to get away with it if you affect the shot that much. Goes up. And he makes the first. Both teams are going to make some substitutions. Daniel picks it up. Substitution. Gets the second to fall as well. North Carolina A&T. Looks like they want to put some more experience on the floor, and they're bringing on the senior for the freshman. The Hornets are really struggling. And it's picked up by North Carolina A&T. The intercept. What great reflexes. He pounced in and picked that one off easily. Johnson. Nice little crossover. Tosses it up. Collected inside by Coleman. That was a much quicker shot than they might have liked, but it was a pretty open look, so it's tough to fault him. Matumbo. His first shot. Bullseye. By 15. Just over five minutes left in the half. Goes up. The layup was banked in by number two. And they're now behind by 13. Chaplin pulls the trigger. Off the mark from 17 feet out. Still a 13-point lead. Tipped away. But it's recovered by number two. Shoots it. Nice lead pass. And the shot was good by Sanders. He's got four. Coleman shoots a three. Coleman. Sinks it. They increase their lead to 14. Johnson brings it up court. Takes it up. The finger roll was laid in by Sandy. And they now trail by 12. Matumbo puts it up and misses. What was that all about? But they're still up by 12. Number two passes to the wing. Beats it to the top of the key. Number two, dishes to the right block. Defensive foul. That's his first personal foul. First team foul. Knocks down the first one. Shooting two. And he'll come away one of two. Wonderful timing. This fella can turn him back with the best of them. Throws it up. Deep three-pointer hit Rush. by Rush. He shoots. Shooting 75% from long range. Number two takes it up. Chaplin pulls it in. Flipped it up and out. His team really needs him to hit that. Last basket on the mark by Coleman. Delaware State is having real turnover problems. Tracy, do you have something for us on that? Coach Jackson is not sugarcoating the issue. He told his assistants, our fundamentals are abysmal. And then added, the only players I want on the floor right now are the ones that can take care of the ball. Thanks, Tracy. The steal by Neal, up ahead. Johnson flips it in for two. But they still trail by 14. 
with the shot. The shot from way downtown was missed by Chaplin. They still have a 14-point lead. Defensive foul. That's his first personal foul. Second team foul. Shooting two. Knocks down the first one. The, court. the Hornets will make some substitutions. He gets them both. Matumbo inbounds the ball. There's no question what kind of defense they're in, Burn. Oh, nice touch on that last three by Coleman. Knocked loose, but it's tracked down by Bright. 240 left in the first half. Sandage catches it on the elbow. Missed shot in the paint by Johnson. Oh, he still That's almost got it to go even foul. with the contact. He'll have to earn foul. the points at the line. Shooting two. And he makes the first. Number 20 makes his first appearance. He's off on the second. Number 20 passes way down court. Pass right side. Chaplin with plenty of space. Puts too much on it. But they still lead by 14. Takes the shot. Finished up with a three by Rush. They're up. 67 to 50 with the jam. They now lead by 19. The Hornets with some difficulties. Number two. Two minutes remaining. Pokes free. And it's scooped up by Rush. Goes up. Slams Rush. home the jam on the breakaway. That's 15 unanswered points. 148 left in the first half. Another rip. Rush picks it up. Throws Rush. it down. By 23. Number two brings it up the floor. Fouled hard, and he'll take a trip to the line. That's his second personal foul. Fourth team foul. Shooting two. He misses the first. Daniel didn't sit for long, and he's coming back into the ball game. He sinks the second. Matumbo inbounds the ball. Daniel passes it up court. Yanked down from well above the rim by Matumbo. That last three pointer was missed by Daniels. The D got away with one there. He had space to shoot, and he usually doesn't miss those. Stolen by Delaware State. Number two. Fouled hard, and he'll take a tip to the line. Personal foul. Team foul. Shooting two. He misses the first. Turner is needed out on the floor. He didn't get much of a rest. Good on number two. Neal is needed out on the floor. He didn't get much of a rest. Has it. Right wing. Launches one from beyond the arc. The offensive rebound pulled down by Turner. With the crossover. Laid in by Daniels. He's got 29. The Hornets need to find some answers here. Seven second differential between the shot clock and the game clock. Up ahead, Chaplin. Tremendous feed right there. So pretty. Bright. Inbounds the ball. Delaware State is really struggling. Right wing. Bright shoots. Gets the three-pointer to go. He's two for three from deep. Raises up. Got it off with time to spare, but the buzzer beater was missed by Daniels. But they're still up by 22. The first half comes to an end with the score 77 to 55. Give us your opinion on the first half, Bill. I can't think of too much good to say about this game so far. Maybe you can do play by play and color. 